channel plus size in Canada. My name is Miranda. It's Monday. It feels like a Monday, but I still have a smile on my face because you have to decide. You have to decide no matter what situation you are in, no matter what is up against you, whatever you're dealing with, you can decide to be happy and flourish in whatever season you're in, even a covid -y season. Yes. <laughs> so this morning was a little bit of a rough start. I mean, it's Monday, so it's already gonna be rough. We didn't get enough sleep on the weekend because we had too much fun, so you know, it's okay. Um, but this morning I had to wake up at 5.30 because the kids that I babysit were getting dropped off very early. Um, their mother has a new job and it's fantastic and it's an early shift, so we're adjusting and I think it will actually be freaking awesome in the summer. Um, during the school week, it's a little bit more difficult because I have to get more kids ready and at school at the same time, but that's okay. Not complaining, very happy to have my babies back. Um, <laughs> anyways, and then, okay, well, Curtis called me. He worked in Kapolei last night, which is where my favorite beach is in the whole entire universe. Oh, okay, more about that later. Okay, so he was on his way home from Kapolei and he's like, let me drive the kids to school. I wanna be able to see them. So just like, I'll call you when I'm getting close so you can get them ready, no problem. He calls me at like 7.25, something like that, almost 7.30, and he's like, yeah, you're gonna have to take them to school. And I'm like, why, what are you doing? And he's like, well, I'm on the side of the road and I popped a tire. So <laughs> yes, he had a flat. I think, well, he thinks he ran over a nail or something, There's, he could visibly see like the hole. <laughs> I can't say certain words and that's one of them. Anyways, he could see the area where the nail or whatever sharp thing busted his tire. He could see like there was a spot. I'm not going to say hole again. Okay. So anyways, long story short, I had to take the kids to school. No problem. Brought them to school, came back home, grabbed a cup of coffee. And then Curtis called me and he's like, yeah, um, I can't get this tire off. Can you bring me my ax so I can beat it off? So that's what I did. So I had to drive to town, turn around, and because I would never go through one of those, you know, those like emergency vehicle only. Curtis was like, you can go through that if you're feeling brave. And I'm like, I'm not brave. <laughs> I'm not doing that. So I drove to town, turned around, came back on the highway, found him, took a couple clips for you guys and for the memories. Anyways, he got a couple calls from friends on his phone that had driven by him like, you okay, buddy? So anyways, everything's fine. He's back home now. He's actually got um, Skylar and the little guy that I babysit outside with him, helping him change all the tires on the car to um, the summer tires anyways. So hopefully we don't get any more snow. <laughs> um, I made some absolutely beautiful banana nut muffins. Holy crap. I'm going to bring these over to my mom and dad because I'll eat them <laughs> and I don't want to. I'm really, oh, I know I talk about this all the time, but it's because it's what's going on in my life. I am really trying to kick my eating disorders ass. I'm trying so hard and sometimes I feel like I don't have the upper hand, but I'm going to reclaim the upper hand. Okay. I'm going to do it because I want to be like healthy and shit, you know, <laughs> have you ever seen, okay, if you guys have TikTok, have you ever heard that thing? Like it's like a sound that somebody made one time. I'm just so sick and tired of being fat. <laughs> I want to be skinny. <laughs> Anyways, that's, I don't want to be skinny. I, I'm okay with fatism. I like it. I'm curvy and I like it. Joey from friends all the time. I love that, but I don't like coming up the stairs and having to turn off my camera because which is what just happened because I'm like can't breathe can't not ready to film I just came up the stairs give yourself a minute Miranda so 
So I don't want to have to do that. Like I'm 35 years old. I have an entire lifetime to be healthy still. And I can do that. I'm going to do that. I'm going to kick my eating disorders ass. I'm going to whip this ass into shape somewhat. <laughs> and I just want to be happy, healthy, and eat all the good things, but also eat all of the not so good things and still be okay with it. You know what I mean? Like just, I'm trying you guys. I'm trying. Don't, don't ever think that I'm not trying. Some days I'm like, I'm not trying, but I'm still trying. Even if I say I'm not trying, it's just a little bit deeper down. I got to dig it out and dust it off. Anyways, I'm going to deliver, <laughs> I'm going to deliver these muffins to my parents. You can tell I've had a lot of coffee this morning. You'd be right. Um, then I'm going to go to the post office and then I'm going to go to the grocery store to get margarine. I usually call it butter, but I decided to call it margarine just for you. Um, I was going to get groceries today. That's not going to happen today because the way the morning went, it's just, it's already 11 o'clock. Like I, I got no time for that. So um, also speaking of the beach, <laughs> want to go to the beach today, guys? I want to go to the beach so bad. So I'm going <laughs> to. Um, when Curtis was driving home and he called me before his tire popped and all that, I'm like, how's the beach look, babe? And he's like, well, I didn't see the beach, but I can certainly see the water. And I'm like, oh, how's it looking? And he's like, it looks really good. I'm like, I want to see it. <laughs> I am. Okay. I know a lot of people don't do like the signs. I don't even do the signs, but I'm a cancer, um, which means if you do the signs, which I don't, so don't, you know, it's okay. I just sometimes I'm like, what does it mean? <laughs> because I never understood until I... I think it came up on Facebook one of these days in the last couple of years that I'm a water sign. I didn't know I was a water sign, but I did know I was a cancer because I used to read the horoscopes in the newspaper when I was a kid. <laughs> Anyways, I really don't follow that stuff, but sometimes, you know, you're just a little bit curious, you know. <laughs> Anyways, so um, I found out a couple of years ago that being a cancer, which I'm a crab, <laughs> oddly enough, um, I don't got them. Just... <laughs> I don't know why I am the way I am. This is just me. Um, anyway, so um, I have a hard shell with a soft interior. And if you are able to crack off my hard shell, then I will be loyal to you to forever. And also you could hurt me with the look. You could hurt me so easily. And that is me to a T. That's exactly who I am. I will fight you, but also then I'll cry. So... <laughs> Anyways, um, so I'm a crab, and also I didn't know. I'm a water sign, and I was like, what does that mean? And then I read it um, on one of these, like, you know when your friends do, like, a Facebook quiz, and then you see their results? It was one of those things. Anyways, so I read, this person was a cancer, too, so it had, like, the thing that goes with a cancer. I was born July 14th, so that's me. Anyways, I read it, and it was like, um, you find solace near the water. As soon as you get near an ocean, you can breathe. And I was like, how did you know? I didn't tell you that. How did you know? That's literally me. That is a hundred percent moi. Water is healing for me. Like, like even just talking about it makes me get goosebumps. Honestly. Um, I used to think it was just PEI that made me feel that way because Every time we would go to PEI, if we were going on the ferry, when we were kids, the ferry was badass, miss it, love it. Um, now there's a bridge. But anyways, anytime we got to um, the place where you would go to PEI, cross the water, um, I would already feel like I'm healed. Like whatever, like I have like a little bit of mood issues, you know, a little bit of depression, a little bit of like um, OCD. Somebody actually said I might have bipolar and I looked at Curtis and I'm like, you think I'm bipolar? And he's like, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> I'm sprinkling a little bit of spice on all of my moods, okay? Um, but um, as soon as I get to the water and I like breathe in that ocean air, I am telling you, like the chains break off of me and I am at one. Like I am at peace with the water. I am one with the earth, with Jesus, all the good things. Like I just, you know what? Jesus can walk on water. So I think he knows about water too, just saying. <laughs> Anyways, I just, water does it for me. So when he went to Cap Lay, I'm like, babe, like, can we go to the beach today? It's going to be 14 degrees, which I don't know that, what that means in Fahrenheit, but that's a lot in Celsius. It's almost shorts weather. Shorts weather is 15 in my house anyways. Um, so 
I want to go to the beach. I, I just really want to go. So I think the days that Addie and Boober get dropped off really early, their mom also picks them up earlier. So I think, I'm not 100%, I'm going to be really sad if it doesn't work out, but we're planning to go to the beach. We're planning it. And I drew, I drew Winnie a beach scene in her lunch. I, I didn't know this. You guys want to know something? You guys know I draw Winnie a picture or I write her a note every day on a piece of paper towel that goes in her lunchbox. I didn't know this, but she shows her entire class every day and everybody wants to know what Winnie's mom put in her lunch. So I'm like, <laughs> that's adorable. I love it. And also, okay, so if you follow me on Instagram, you saw a picture that looked a little something like this this morning, you know, with the mini and the mini. And guess what I just put on you guys? Do you love it? Bow earrings. Oh, isn't that so perfect? So I'm like, <laughs> you know, <laughs> anyways, I should probably stop drinking coffee now. I'm just too excited, I'm too excited. Like I said, there can be a pile of shit on your doorstep, but you can choose to make the most out of every situation. So you take that shit, you remove it, fertilize it, baby. Use it to your advantage. Positivity, guys. Happiness is usually a choice, not every time, but usually you can decide to be happy no matter what pile of shit is in your doorstep this morning. You know what I'm saying? I love you. Stay with me, we're gonna have a good day. You guys see that sun? Looks like beach weather to me. All right, guys, I'm about to start cooking lunch, but <laughs> I felt like opening some presents first. You guys are so freaking sweet to me. Like, I love you guys. Thank you. Thank you for surprises. I love surprises. Oh my goodness, you guys. I just had to like stop filming and go back and watch what I just filmed because the post office did a little whoopsie because they put something that I ordered um, and shipped it to like my real address. They accidentally put the like slip to it, like the little card. They put that in my PO box address. I get, I, okay, so the thing is, is like they know I get packages. It's a very small town. Um, my dad also works at the post office. And so I'm guessing they're probably talking about me. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, so this, I had to just delete a little part of the video I just filmed because it had my real address on it. And here he goes again. Anyways, okay, so the first package that I opened that I thought was a surprise is something that I bought. So <laughs> it's the fishies for the wall. And I don't know why, but they also sent me one red fish. I don't know. Um, but anyways, it says just peel and stick. Thank you for your order. Um, yeah. They look really like a good size. That's exactly what I wanted. I was worried they might be a little too big. Uh, I can't talk about size. Too immature. Anyways, okay, I'm glad that I got those. It's so weird because, um, man, Etsy, they're all screwed up right now because I'm assuming it's because of COVID. Um, but like every company is just kind of all over the place and I don't know when I'm getting stuff. And so anyways, okay. I bought that. Okay, on to the presents. This first present says it's fragile and it's from my friend Gail. And I think she might be in PEI, I think. Cause I'm not, I think PE is, yeah, I think that's PEI. It always confuses me because I feel like, like New Brunswick stand, like NB stands for New Brunswick and S stands for Nova Scotia. Newfoundland is NL. PEI should just be PEI. <laughs> In my head, that's what makes sense to me. It should just be PEI. Why does it need a two letter? It should be a three letter. You're a special little place. I don't know why I've always thought that way. It, it makes sense to me, I guess. I don't know. I'm weird with numbers. You guys know that. Okay, here we go. Okay. Um, okay, there's a letter. So I want to read this first. Thank you so much, Gail. Oh, look. So she sent a little something for everybody. These are really cute. Butterfly stickers. I've never seen these. 
Those are really adorable. Winnie's gonna love those. And aw, I know who these are for. <laughs> Cute, he's sleeping somewhere right now. I'm surprised he's not over here. I think Curtis carrying all the big items inside probably scared him over into a corner somewhere. He is so scared of everything. It's, oh, it breaks my heart. Hold on. Is he over there hiding from he's you? Sleeping. Yeah, because that's why, honestly. Probably fake and sleep and just to keep away. Exactly, like anytime we open the closet and pull out the vacuum cleaner, he's terrified. The hula hoop, he's terrified. Like anything big, oh. <laughs> I really need to grow up, okay, I know. Ah, oh, okay. Kit Kat, I like them big. I like them chunky. Um, this used to be one of my favorite chocolate bars back in the day when I worked at the Big Stop because they had these with caramel under them. I don't, like it was Kit Kat chunky caramel. I don't know if they even still have those because I really don't ever buy them anymore. Oh, a whole pack. Holy crap. That's awesome. Thank you, Gail. And something rocky with yeah no, i just i was winning so cool. that's the winning song so fun thank you gail and i don't look how good she packaged this oh my goodness all right let's see if i can crack into it without hurting it Ooh, or hurting myself i got into it and i'm definitely keeping that bubble wrap for the kids they're going to love it oh it's a mug it's a mug it's a mug it's a mug oh oh Johnny Circuit Creations. This is so cool. Mermaid juice. <laughs> I'm going to the beach, guys. This is perfect. Thank you so much, Gail. This is so sweet. Oh, my heck. Winnie's going to love this, too. So freaking cute. I love it. I love it. I love it. Thank you. And it got here in one piece. That's so exciting. So my friend Tara, who is like, she's like legitimately like my girl. You know what I'm saying? Like, Everyone's my friend, and then there's a few of you that like we talk pretty much every single day, and I pretty much know who you are, and you definitely know who I am, you know what I'm saying? So, hey to all my girls, how you doing? Anyways, Tara sent me another package, you guys. If you've watched an unboxing video before, you know who Tara is. She's a badass. She works at a prison. Seriously. She would kick your ass, I know that. <laughs> You guys, I have too much fun. I for real have too much fun. But like, life is too short. Heels you! <laughs> I love it. She's got the best cards too, you guys. I don't even know where she's buying them from. You're like every cat video ever. I never get tired of seeing you. Aw, that's so cute. Winnie's gonna love that too. Some summer swag, cause you need options. Oh, you're the best, you're the best, you're the best. All right, let's see. Is this, oh, okay, sweet. Okay, cause she always has cool stickers. Now I know where she got them from this booklet. Look at this little mouse yelling roar. <laughs> oh, dainty is for teacups. Yes, yes, I am. I might be a woman, okay? But I will never be sweet or quiet, okay? <laughs> And this is for all my people who think I have a potty mouth. Swearing helps, okay? Yes, it does. I just don't take the Lord's name in vain. Love you, Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. All other words, go for it. As long as it's not hurting anyone or being mean to anyone. Maybe being mean to some people, but... <laughs> Anyways, this is so cool. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much. What is, what is in this box? What is in this box? I put my in a box. <laughs> oh, it's a dis. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. <gasps> if I cried still, because I really don't cry anymore, if I did, holy crap. I think, is this the one that we actually saw at Hallmark in the glass case? Oh my heck, you guys. I think it is. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. 
Ah! You guys! Oh. You guys, I love it so much! <laughs> I love it! Oh my goodness! It's called Be Kind. Oh, Tara! You are the buzz to my bee. <laughs> you are the ink in my squid. <laughs> you are the Patrick to my SpongeBob. <laughs> you are the rainbow after my rain. I love you. I love you. You guys, this means everything to me. And I needed one more thing up there. <laughs> because I wanted to move, actually, okay, what I'd like to do, Okay, get a load of this. What I'd like to do is make this my Beauty and the Beast wall so that the only thing that would be on this wall is Beauty and the Beast things. We do have some family pictures up a little bit higher. You can't see it by the way that I have the camera angled right now. But you know um, what Curtis got me that was in that box? The um, pictures, they're like cards, but like pictures from production of the movie. Um, I'd like to get some of those framed and put them up there as well. Um, you know, and we have the up house, which I absolutely adore and Mickey and Minnie, which, hello, like, hello, I love. But I just, I wanna spread it out a little bit further. Like, I just, I don't know, guys. I think I found, like, my people online in a way because, like, I am seeing, and you guys are sending me so many TikToks, so many Instagram posts that remind you of me, and it's Disney moms. Like, there are a lot of us, okay? And I didn't know it was a thing. I really didn't. I didn't know this loving Disney and like buying Disney stuff like crazy for your house. I didn't know that was a thing. I really didn't. And I love that thing. <laughs> Not that thing, guys, because you remember, I just got poked real hard. <laughs> That's not what I meant. Remember, I got my IUD put in. There's no bedroom Olympics happening in this house at all right now. Oh my goodness. I'm so bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> you guys, this is everything. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I am so scared that something's going to fall. And now that I said it, knock on wood, knock on wood, because it scares me to say stuff like that. Because I feel like if I say it, it's going to come true. You know what I mean? Ah, oh, whoo. All right, you guys, there's more. <laughs> Is this a shirt? It's a shirt, it's a shirt, it's a shirt, it's a shirt. Oh my heck! You guys, look! Moana's on it! <laughs> oh my goodness, Moana does not have enough res rep respiration, representation, she does not. Moana needs to be all up in this, for real. We got Moana, we got Snow White, we got Jasmine, we got Ariel, we got Belle, we got Rapunzel. Ah, oh, <laughs> where do you find this stuff? It's probably right from the Disney store. Is the Disney, tell me, is the Disney store closed everywhere now? Because our Disney store shut down, of course, the year that I became a mother, thanks a lot. Um, so that was sad. Um, and I heard in the news like lately, like in the last month, that more stores were closing, more Disney stores. And I wondered like, is it all the Disney stores that are closed now, like in the universe, except for like at Disney parks, you know what I mean? Or um, is it just like another chunk of Disney stores have gone and there still is a Disney store? Because like, honestly, I don't even understand how this is happening. Well, I guess I do, because money and COVID and blah, blah, blah. But, um, I didn't need to blah, blah, blah over that. I do take the pandemic very seriously and I'm yeah, just trying to stay positive. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? <laughs> you guys, literally sometimes I make no sense at all. I haven't had one sip of alcohol in like, you guys, it's been too long. I can't even remember. You wanna know why? I hate to say it. We have no Diet Coke in the house. I know. I'm ashamed. I'm ashamed. We haven't had any for like a while. It's been like, well, a while. It's been like three or four days. <laughs> but we've been out and I'm like, no, okay, I'm going to Costco. I'm going to Costco. And then I still haven't got there. So hopefully tomorrow you will see a Costco haul pop up from your girl. And I'm thinking I should buy two flats, not just one. Just saying, I don't want to get in this predicament. Like we're almost to drinking season and I need to keep my... My stanima, 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 stanima. It doesn't sound right, but I think it is. <laughs> and you guys, I'm not wearing a shirt under this. I'm literally 
<laughs> you want a scene? <laughs> I just have my bra on. I got dressed so quickly this morning. Hold my ass upstairs as possibly quick, as quick as possible. Wow. Speak is hard today, apparently. So I need a shirt anyways. So I can't even believe it. I can't even believe it. This is just making everything so m How many? I'm losing my shit. You guys, there's so much in here. <laughs> Oh, okay, Tara, if you ever come to Canada, come this way. Come this way, baby. We'll go shopping in real life together. We would have a blast. Oh my goodness, there's so many of you that I want to shop with and it would be, we would get in so much trouble. Like I just, oh my heck. <laughs> we really would and it would be so fun. You know what would be actually like really, really fun. And I'm not even saying this might never happen because maybe it will. Maybe someday we will do like a meetup and we'll pick a location and we'll all go to that location, like travel to that location, fly, whatever you got to do. And like have, like we'll rent out a room. We'll have some drinks together. We'll go out to bars together. We'll go shopping together. It'd be like a whole, wouldn't that, I'm dying right now. I would love that. And you guys know who would love that the most? Winnie, except for the drinking part. But she would have so much fun. Oh my goodness, we should do that. Hurry up, COVID. <laughs> I don't want to, I am taking it seriously. I feel like every time I say that, I'm not taking it seriously. So like I am. And um, Curtis actually had a really close call the other day at work. Like I know people are like, it's not affecting you personally, but like it is. So... <laughs> Um, don't worry. Everything's okay. It's just, there have been majorly close calls and it's only a matter of time. It's only a matter of time till I won't get to see, I, this is how I truly feel. There's going to come a point in time where he's going to have to self isolate away from us. And I'm going to, you're going to see Miranda spiral. <laughs> You'll see it. Um, I just think this whole variant thing is, Oh, you guys, like, I can't think too much about it. And also that's why, like, I haven't been keeping up with all the news because I just can't, I just can't. I know my limit and my limit is like this big right now. <laughs> why can't I talk about sizes? I am so bad, you guys, I'm so bad. Okay, keep moving. This says Toy Story. This says Toy Story. Okay, before I open it this morning, I just have, I have goosebumps, you guys. I have goosebumps. Um, this morning, Cooper was like, mom, which one's your favorite mug? Was it Cooper? I think it was Cooper. And I was like, I don't know. I looked around and I was like, probably either Lilo and Stitch or Toy Story. That's like, oh, oh. Disney just has so much meaning to me. And I know a lot of you guys don't like Disney and I understand, I understand. Um, but also like, Disney is like Star Wars is Disney now. So is Marvel. Like there's so much stuff that's actually Disney now. So it's kind of hard not to love something. But I like I watched. Oh, I don't even want to get into it because well, I can't cry anyways. But I just <laughs> this video is going to be so long. And if we end up going to the beach today, which I really, 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 really want to. Um, it's I don't I'm not going to want to edit forever when I get back home. So <gasps> no way. Oh, my God. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I'm going to have to do a fashion show. I totally am like Disney fashion show. Oh my goodness. I still have to cook lunch. Dang it. I forgot all about lunch. I got too excited. You didn't. Can you guys guess? You already know. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Are you kidding me? I am going to be the sexiest girl. Like, you know, some girls are like, Ooh, let me like take my shirt and like put it through the top and pull it. No. <laughs> or like, Oh, you know, what's a new thing on TikTok? The under boob, the under boob. <laughs> That's never going to be a thing here, but I am going to be sexy AF with this on. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I love it. <laughs> Thank you so much, Tara. I'm really losing my mind. There's two more. I love it. I love it. And this one is a, this one is a tie dye Mickey. Oh, this might be beach wear today. <gasps> Look, and it's the perfect size. Look at that three X and it's going to fit. Yes. <laughs> Woo. It really does depend. I'm not always a three X, but like if I'm buying something online, I'm ordering a three X because I'm going to wear it. And if I get something too, what are you doing? 
That dude just drove directly into my yard. Okay, um, one of our neighbors is moving and they have a big storage container and now they have another big storage container. I don't know, you guys, I don't know. I th Actually, you know what, it probably is. Curtis was thinking about this. Dude's in my yard again. Okay, big friggin' like, big truck. You can probably hear it. Anyways, I still gotta cook lunch, geez Louise, okay. <laughs> Um, Curtis was thinking they sold their house and didn't get a new house yet and that's why they have these big giant storage containers or like shipping containers because oh or maybe they're shipping their stuff I don't know but right now I don't know if it's like this where you live but where we live um, you put up house up for sale it's gone the same day like it is I can't remember if it I think it's a seller's market right now I don't know if it's a buyer I don't know the term right I do it the wrong way but if you guys want to come and move to New Brunswick right now, start looking for houses right away because good luck. It is very, very hard to get a house right now. Okay, this is fantastic. Whew, okay, we're, oh, this is amazing because I see it. Oh, it's the whole gang. It's the whole gang, you guys. <laughs> hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog. Bring, 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 hot dog. <laughs> I grew up, or I, my kids grew up watching um, Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. They were obsessed. And then Winnie was obsessed when she was very, very little. We watched it so much. That old Pete always up to some trouble. <laughs> Honestly, we watched oh, the same episode so many times. Oh my goodness. When um, Goofy is a babysitter, it's called Goofy Babysitter, where accidentally all the gang turns into babies and then Goofy has to babysit them and Clarabelle comes and, <laughs> and she sings them a lullaby and she's like, good night. <laughs> this is literally, I, all, I just can't. Like, you guys, I'm not even done opening and I am like the happiest I actually was starting to get a little bit of a headache. I just popped two Advil and I was like, I don't even know where my headache went now. It's totally gone. Oh, this is amazing. This is amazing. Best day ever. I love it. Thank you so much. I don't even care about lunch anymore. <laughs> I feel kind of bad for my husband because I still got to cook for him. Skylar already ate. Oh yeah, I got to get boober food too. So yeah, I got some bacon out. I'll make some bacon. What goes with bacon? Sandwiches? I don't know. <laughs> We'll figure it out. Oh, my land. Curtis was going to take a nap, but I think it took him so long to change the tires on the car that he's just like, maybe I'll just sleep on the way to the beach and you can drive, which is like shocking because he absolutely hates sitting in the passenger seat. But also I get car sick when he drives because you guys have been in the car with us before. He is a maniac. And like, I'm a maniac, but in a good way. And he's like, ooh, ooh, like pick a speed, pick a speed. <laughs> Okay, this came from Amazon, but it came on behalf of, okay, well, it might be a last name. So we'll see if there's a name on the end. <laughs> oh my heck, okay, hold on, there's a little note. Oh, it's for Winnie, okay. Um, but a little disappointed. <laughs> and actually, it's totally fair because I just got so much stuff. So that's actually really good because um, she actually, Tara sent Winnie a package too, but it's not here yet. Um, actually, she just told me she got something for the boys too because she's, look at this. She's so sweet. This is amazing. Oh, there's a little castle. Oh, there's a castle in the bottom. Oh, Winnie is going to, this is, I got to wash it right away. I'm going to wash it right away. She can take this to the beach. Ah, this is, look at the little handle. Allison, Owen's got that. Oh, and she's going to be able to do this. Sorry, guys, I'm having all the thoughts right now. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is so fun. I wonder if this is Disney Store, too. I bet you it is. I bet you. Or maybe it's Amazon Prime. That makes sense, too. Oh, thank you so much, Allison. You are so, so sweet. Look at the princesses, guys. Oh, I love it. Oh, Tiana. I, we need to watch her movie again too because we haven't watched Princess Princess and the Frog since she was a baby. Look how gorgeous Cinderella looks. She get a little Botox or something? Do y'all thing, Cinderella. Look at her. Oh my heck. Well, they all look great. Ooh, Aurora is looking fiercely bitchy. <laughs> oh my heck, you guys. Okay, I'm gonna make some lunch really quick. 
I'm gonna do a fashion show, but you might have to wait till tomorrow to see that because I don't know if I got time today, but I'm definitely taking this baby off and putting one of those on because mama's roasting like a turkey on Thanksgiving. <laughs> in case you were wondering what the heck I was on about, there's a big shipping container in the back of that truck and there's another one up the street. I know I'm totally crazy, but I'm not that crazy. There really was a truck there. <laughs> These stickers yeah. are from Gail. So what do we say to Gail? Thank you. <laughs> Aren't they beautiful? Yeah. Look at them. I've never seen anything like that before. Me and you right here, baby. Yep. <laughs> this Cooper and this and this daddy. Mm -hmm. This is from Allison. <laughs> What's that? A castle? I can't see it. It's a freaking yeah. castle. Can you believe it? it like uh-huh. We gotta wash it and put something in it first. Doesn't it look good? That's cool how it opens. I know. <laughs> and look how pretty Cinderella oh. is. Look at, look, hold on. Look at Cinderella. Look at that face. Look at Tiana's face. I know. Aurora and Jasmine. What do you say to Allison? Thank you. Thank you. Oh. You guys. We're at the beach. <laughs> you guys hear that sound? <sighs> so Puppy awesome. Prince. Puppy Prince, guys. <laughs> Puppy Prince, nice. It's cold water. I mean, cold. Is it cold? It's probably really cold. Yup. <laughs> Definitely cold. <laughs> Polka dots. <laughs> Curtis just informed me that uh, my caprice. I can, I can read Calvin Klein on her rear end. <laughs> Whoopsies! <laughs> Doesn't that just make you so happy? <sighs> that was a good run, sis. Yes, with your walking stick. Do you want to go search for some seashells with me? Yeah, it is cool. It's like a pipe though. It's like a god. Nice. Look. That's a good one, huh? Six. Ooh. I think that's a clam, maybe? Something like that. Which height? Yeah. Want some lettuce? Some lettuce? Some lettuce? <laughs> nom nom nom. <laughs> Look, you guys. Beautiful. You missed this, Mom. Ooh, nice find. What did he find? A stick? Driftwood! Driftwood? <laughs> I found it. Can you guys breathe better now, too? It's so fun. It's so fun. I need to live here. Yep. Right where those people live. Right yep. there. Totally agree. Can we come off? We should go see if it's for sale. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. Oh. In French. What is it in French? A cow. A cow. Oui. <sighs> Beautiful. Best day ever. But the boys didn't want to come. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be We're not the only ones on the beach, guys. Can you tell? There's some people over there. There's not a ton of people here, but everyone knows it's sunny, so there's a nice little crew. <laughs> Look at that ass. <laughs> Back to the warm sand. Yeah. Into the sand. Mm-hmm. 
This is my stick, don't forget. Okay. Look. My stick, my stick, my stick. Here we go. Look. In the erection. Curtis. <laughs> it's erect. <laughs> I can't wait to do this all summer long when it's actually warm. And it is nice. It's just, you know, Mom, a little I should get my pants dirty and sit down. Yeah, Mommy brought Winnie a change of clothes. So I can sit down. Yeah, you can get as dirty as you want. The only thing we forgot was the motorbike. <laughs> Drop everything. Drop everything. You found the big kahuna. Nice. You have to keep that. Yeah, for sure. So, <laughs> so this is nice. Good find, Mama. Road leads back to the place I know. I cannot go where I long to be. Heck yeah. Look what we found, guys. A crab shell. <laughs> Is it kind of gross? Yeah. Yeah. That looks cool. Let's play it. Yeah. <laughs> Do not put that in your mouth. We found some sea sponge. We found SpongeBob, guys. Me, me, me. I found it. Do not put that in your mouth. Winter back. I found it. I found it. I found it. Yes, you did. Now, where's Patrick? We got to find a That's sea it. star now. <laughs> this girl is shivering to death. So I brought a change of clothes for her. We're going to go to the car, get her dressed. Then we're going to stop at McDonald's and get her a little supper. Are <laughs> She's you so cold. kidding me right here? <laughs> <laughs> Who picked this? Is? I picked that. We're bringing it home. <laughs> like, <laughs> thank you guys for coming to the beach with us. We'll have many more beach days coming. <laughs> nice. <gasps> oh, magical crab claw. Nice. Yeah. We love you guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye from the driftwood. Au revoir. Au revoir. Ha, ha, ha.